further as of now? I think it's four. I think he had two the opening weekend, and that was it. And then I guess I think I have two. Okay. So. Mikhail, uh, obviously, pitched well on the mound. You guys uh, support him. Does he like that practice also? Oh, yeah, I love Mikhail. Uh, he doesn't really throw a four seam. He has a, he has a little cutter that he throws, 87, 88, 89. And his, his curveball, his curveball, well, his spin rate is above average major league pitcher. So his curveball is unbelievable. And he's a really energetic guy. And I, and the whole the whole team loves him. So. What's he like off the field? I mean, he's he's a pretty chill dude. Uh, he's, he's very outgoing and... Sometimes he's quiet, but I mean, you can just tell he's getting focused for the game. And uh, other than that, he's a, honestly he's a great friend. He's always he's always uh, he's always giving me a hug and everything. And I love him to death. And I wouldn't want anybody on the mound in a tough situation other than Mikael. So. Coach said this is really the Mikael you guys saw in the fall ball, sort of. Oh yeah, Mikael Mikael in fall was very dominant. Uh, him and him and Devin really stood out as the freshmen and. Uh, we knew, we knew we were going to have to count him in big games. And he came in when we were losing, and he shut the door, and he, kept, he, threw, he threw a bunch of zeros on the board, and that's all we needed him to do.